Good evening, everyone. The body of 66-year-old David Brialt of Escanaba was recovered from underneath the ice this morning on Little Bay, Danak. Officials received a call at about 8.45 a.m. A fisherman noticed a collapsed ice shack on the ice with another item beside it. The fisherman investigated, and that's when they discovered that the other item was a four-wheeler. Half submerged, and Brialt was under the water. TV6 Escanaba Bureau reporter Jessica Stevenson was at the scene of the accident today. And we're actually looking at an experienced ice fisherman here that uh, knew, we believe knew the area quite, quite well, but accidents do happen. It's a tragedy. Although it is suspected Baralt went through the ice quite early this morning, emergency personnel responded to the scene as though it were a rescue. Uh, we would treat it just like we would treat our own families. We respond to the incident with uh, great regard for the person's safety and our safety and, uh, and do everything that we possibly can to make things happen. According to officials on the scene, there were tracks indicating Baralt had driven over this area safely before. So what made this trip different? Conditions were, uh, were less than wonderful on the ice that uh, this incident had occurred at. Uh, there were multiple pressure cracks which were freshly opened due to boat activity in the shipping canals, which uh, made it a hazardous area. And that was reporting from our Jessica Stevenson there at the scene. Officials say no matter how experienced of an ice fisherman you are, and even if you drove over that particular area of ice just hours before, always be prepared.